Good morning, Rosa Parks. Today is Tuesday, October 22nd, 2019. At this time, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, which today will be led by Mrs. Mancourt's class. I pledge Great job, Mrs. Mancourt's class. Boys and girls, you may be seated. Today for lunch in the cafeteria, we are having walking taco with toppings, peanut butter and jelly encrustable with street cheese stick, green beans or refried beans, fruit, and milk. We have no students or staff members celebrating a birthday today. It is time for your Fitbit moment. I apologize that yesterday everyone saw you standing like this. I will try to get those fixed. Um, but at this time, please stand up for your Fitbit moment where your brain is active and your body is active. Good morning, boys and girls. And in today for our Fitbit moment, we are going to do some arm stretches. So right now, what I want you to do is stand up. You're gonna put one arm this way and we're gonna hold it for five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Now we're gonna switch and we're gonna put this arm and we're gonna hold this for five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Great job, boys and girls. At this time, remain standing for our moment of silence. I love that everyone is getting fit and active and an active brain means an active learner. All right, boys and girls, at this time, it is time for our moment of silence. So at this time, I'd like you to think about three ways that you can be a good helper today. Maybe that's being a good helper in the cafeteria. Maybe that's being a good helper in your classroom. Maybe that's being a good helper on the bus. But think about three ways that you can be a good helper today at school. So right now, let's bow our heads and think about three ways that we can be a good helper. Thank you. You may be seated. I hope you thought of three ways that you can be a good helper or three people that maybe you can help today. All right. You're probably looking at this way. Why is Snoopy on the board? Well, this morning we have some special visitors from Perry Meridian High School who are going to put on a play for us. Um, it's actually a special play called a musical where they will tell the story through songs and dances. And so this morning, um, not long from now, we will go into the gym and we will watch the high schoolers perform a good, you're a good man, Charlie Brown, which is a story um, about Charlie Brown and Snoopy. And so when we're in the gymnasium, it is very important that we are sitting on our bottoms so that everyone can see that we're very quiet so that we can all hear the performers. There may be times when it's okay to clap. There may be times when it's okay to laugh out loud, but when they're singing and talking, we need to make sure that we are listening so that we can hear everything happening in the great play, our great musical. So to, in a few minutes, I'll be calling you down uh, for the You're a Good Man, Charlie Brown, and make sure that we show those Perry Meridian High School kids how great our students are. All right, boys and girls, it is time for our daily goal. As we are getting ready for the You're a Good Man, Charlie Brown performance, I want our daily goal to be working on keeping our lips and our mouths quiet when other people are talking. So today, when we're watching the musical and they're singing and dancing and talking, we are actively listening so that we can hear everything happening. As always, don't forget to treat people right. My thing froze. And you do the right thing. Shine brightly, stars. Have a terrific Tuesday.